A lot of artists can go on painting the, the material of art schools, but I think the best artists start inventing their own worlds. She's a living legend, there's no doubt. Grace is one of the last people tied to one of the most significant movements in American art. William de Kooning, Franz Klein, Hans Hoffmann. This was the environment that Grace was painting in. That was her world. She was the only woman artist featured both in the 12 American show and American painting shows of the 1950s, two seminal shows. Her first interest was always the art. Relationships were second, families were second. Where you lived was second, what you ate was second. The art, the art, the art. But during the 1960s, as critics like Clement Greenberg came to prominence, a doctrinaire approach to painting came into fashion. Clement Greenberg told me in no uncertain terms that I had to stop working from the masters. And I told him what he could do with himself. And we never really spoke after that. Clem wanted you to do what he wanted you to do. And when you didn't do what Clem wanted you to do, he just pushed you aside. She didn't look to others for approval or advice. Grace kept that fire burning with absolutely no help from anybody else. Nobody was doing what she was doing. The triumph, even to this day, of getting up every day and going to her studio, it's just the most incredible thing to see. She is truly the embodiment of what a true artist should be, man or woman.